Hey, what's up there party people? My name is Thavius Beck, and in the following video course, I'm gonna show you some very interesting Max for Live devices that we can utilize for video. These devices can utilize either our webcam, such as what I'm doing right now. Uh, what you're seeing me on is a device that we can utilize in Ableton Live called CamBot. It's one of the first ones we're gonna check out. Uh, these devices can also utilize video clips. And the last thing I wanna show you is something that can generate 3D imagery that reacts to your music. The majority of these devices, pretty much all of them except for I think one, is free and available from a website called maxforlive.com, which you'll be seeing throughout the course. Now before we get started, it's important to make sure that you have Max for Live properly set up on your computer, otherwise you're not gonna be able to take advantage of the things that I'm gonna show you. Another point that I wanna make is that for the devices that I'm using, I'm utilizing the 64-bit version of Ableton Live. Uh, if you use these devices on the 32-bit version, you might run into some different issues. Some of them may work better, some of them may not work at all. So just so you know, I'm using the 64-bit version of Live and we're gonna be utilizing Max for Live to take advantage of video within Ableton. Before we get started, let's make sure that we all have Max for Live properly installed on our computer.